So in Blender, what you can easily also do is bring in an object. And if you were to click and drag the object, you can capture up the motion uh, according to uh, the mouse drag that you do. So in order to do that, you, you need to first of all go around and then bring in an object. So over here in the Blender viewport, I'm going to press Shift A right here. And then over here in the um, mess section, I'm going to bring in a torus as the object of my choice. So now what you can do is you can capture this around. So to capture it, I'm going to go around, hit the auto keyframe option right here. And to do the capture, you can hit the play animation. And simply what you can do is you can click and drag around the object. So I'm going to go around, press Z right here so that uh, you can see that this is what I have. So the object is selected. And as this actually goes around, you can see that the motion has been captured. So if I were to press the play button now, as it reaches that point, you can see that this is the motion that was captured right here. So everything for all of the things right here, the keyframe has been added in just like this. So just make sure the auto keying is turned on right here, press the play button and move your object according to how you like it. So if I were to go around and click and drag it, you can see that all of the keyframes has been set right here. So if I were to go around into, let's say for example, onto uh, this menu right here, if I were to go to graph, editor, this is what I have, as you can see right here. So all of the keyframes, according to the mouse movement has been captured out. So that is how you can do mouse motion capture inside of Blender. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.